So this question starts off by providing us with this function here, p of t equals 290 times 1.04 to the 4 sixth t power. Anytime I see a variable in the exponent, um, I think that I really want to know what does it mean when that variable is equal to zero? Like what does t equal zero really mean here? I always want to figure that out. I haven't read this yet to see if that's valuable, but I just wanted to make note of that before I start reading. So the question says the function p models the population in thousands of a certain city t years after 2005. So t, t equals zero would be the year 2005, right? No years after 2005. According to the model, the population is predicted to increase by n percent every 18 months. Okay, what is the value of n? So it's predicted to increase by n percent every 18 months. All right, so I know that t is years. So I could do quite a few things here. So I could say, I could say what happens at t equals zero. And I could also say what happens at t equals 1.5. Because 1.5 years is the same as 18 months. So let's do that. When t equals zero, and I'll use a different color. When this is zero, that makes this whole thing zero. Any number to the zero power is just one. And we get 290, right? Which is why I like to use zero there. So basically, p of zero is equal to 290. So what happens at p of 1.5? I may need to use my calculator here. Um, so now I'm saying that t is... 1.5. I can use 3 halves if I want to keep things as a fraction. Um, yeah, why not? 1.5 and 3 halves are the same thing. So I'm multiplying by 3 halves. If I multiply this by 3 halves, multiply 4 6 times 3 halves, I get 12 twelfths. Oh, nice. Which is obviously just 1. So that turns into 290 times 1.04 to the first power, which is not important to write. So then I'm, I have the exact same number that I started off with here is 290. Sorry for erasing that on accident. But I'm just multiplying that 290 by 1.04. So my percent increase here is found all in the 1.04. So 1.04 represents a 4% increase. Here's why. So 1.04 is the same as 104%, okay? 104% basically means we have 100% of what we have. So one year and a half after 2005, we have maintained the population that we had. So we have 100% of it, plus we've added an additional 4%. Like that's how we, that's how we interpret this 1.04. So 4% is the increase. So if we're talking about n percent, that means that our n value must equal 4, and therefore choice C must be correct.